Hey all guys, it's me again Mark and for today's video, I'll be sharing to you 5 things that you need to do before your online class or before your virtual class. Yeah, finally nakabalik din, nakapag-shoot din sa ayo. Medyo naging busy kasi ako in this last class. Mga, yeah, busy. So ito, bumabawi. So yeah, let's get started! Marchie. First thing that you need to do before your virtual class, uh, fix yourself. So, hilamos, mag toothbrush. So, required ba maliko? Depende. Kung yung schedule nyo sa class is somehow tight, wala kayong long breaks, like an hour, an hour break. So, yun. Pwede na maligo ng umaga, but sa akin, if hindi kaya na umabot sa klase dahil maligo ko or what something, ilamas it's in toothbrush lang yung ginagawa. Second thing, second thing that you need to do before your online class is to peel off your tummy. Baby, kumain ka na ba? So, dapat make sure natin na, yeah, nakapag-breakfast tayo and somehow yung kakainin natin is hindi sobrang bigat at hindi rin, yeah, hindi sobrang bigat na baka mag ng, you know, tummy aches during your class or some, alam niyo na, yung pinatin mo, sana ba ganun? Just like, Eat healthy and somehow light foods, right? Then, yeah. Next thing that you need to do before your online class is to prepare the things that you need. So, like yung phone, magsiset up ka ng camera, ng headphones, and everything. But depende yun sa yo. Yeah, kasi kapag laptop naman yung gagamitin mo, di pa just have to put it on the table then okay na ganyan but ako kasi phone yung ginagamit ko no, sa online class so ginagawa ko nagsiset ko talaga ako ng phone then yun tsaka yung mga ginagamit ko din pang notes yeah for note taking nire-ready ko din like the notebook yung mga notebook pens things need pang note taking yeah Okay, so yun. That is very parang common naman na kailangan ng gawin. Next thing that you need to do before your virtual class is to ensure that your study space is free from distraction. What I mean is to ensure that your environment is somehow um, tahimik. You have your focus in terms of studying. Hindi yung somehow mo minimize natin yung noise. Ganon kind sana para naren kung in case na magbubos ka ng microphone during your virtual class, hindi siya masadong like masadong maingay. But ah yon hindi masadong maingay. Tapos kung may mga pets kayo in such a room na yon na pwede to mahal or might cause some noise, like mag meow meow sila. So, pwede naman na natin silang ilagay sa labas para na rin makapag-focus tayo sa online class. <laughs> Last thing that you need to do before your online class is absolutely to prepare yourself. So, dapat ikaw mismo handa ka. What I mean is that if this is your first online class, expect class introductions, orientations, then like expect that then you introduce yourself. But if this is your first month, your first week, so to be hand na kapag tapos ang mga intro intro, so it's your time to somehow learn or somehow may mga um. Baka kasi may mga times na makaka-encounter tayo na 
the first month, first week na, or end na ng isang lesson, we should expect that there should be some ec- uh, recap questions. Like, what you've learned from this lesson, or what you've learned from your grade 11 lesson to now, or can you summarize the previous lesson, or you share your learnings, your knowledge about the new lesson. So, same time, you need to do an advanced reading if possible. Kung may mga materials ka naman, like you have the books or yung modules nyo, release na a week before your online class. So, yun, maging advantage mo yun kung magbabasa ka na kagad ng book. And at the same time, yun, you have to be prepared in terms of recitations if possible. In terms of, um, you know, in terms of certain activities na maayong nung happen, mangyari, manghappen, <laughs> mangyari during your birthday class. Yeah. To sum it up, guys, first thing is to fix yourself. Next thing is to make sure that you already fill your tummy. Next is to prepare the things that you need. Next is to ensure that your body's uh, sick is to ensure that your study space is free from distractions. And the last but not the least is to prepare yourself. So hopefully, nakatulong itong video na to para sa inyo. Kasi yes, I'm also practicing this thing since mag isang buwan na rin akong sa virtual kind of setup. <laughs> Thank you for watching guys. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Leave a comment down for more um, suggestions kung anong yung want you na maging content ko sa mga next videos pa. Okay. Thank you for watching again. Yeah. <laughs>